Hey bitch, I filmed this shit like a million times already, so at this point, you get what you get, okay? So pay attention, so we don't fuck shit up. Um, yeah. Anyways, I know you guys have been asking me for a damn store from... I didn't get accepted, okay? I didn't get accepted. There, I just said it. So, I'm sorry to all my lazy girls, y'all are fucked. Anyways... Here I am laying that damn cuticle bead. I know you guys have heard this a million times. You don't place that shit right over the cuticle. You want to press that bitch in there and then just pray to the narrow gods that it does not flat. Okay. Anyways, please get your structure down first. Then worry about your three bead method. Here I am adding another apex bead. And I'm just doing this because if these nails break on us, it's a little embarrassing, babe. You know. That's a little embarrassing and we don't want that to happen. So now my shit's all uneven and I gotta go and add another bead to my extension. I'm just blend in like it look beautiful. Here you go. Now watch me do this ombre because honestly you can't tell me that I did it now this shim. We're gonna be doing a lot of tap 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 and drag. Okay, like I said, pay attention. You don't wanna fuck this shit up and you wanna make a beautiful ombre. Yeah. Just like that. Now look how far I placed my cuticle bead from the actual cuticle. And now I'm pushing that shit in there. As I said. You know, because if your shit floods, I don't know what to tell you. And really, I'm sorry. Tragic. Anyways. Also, remember to encapsulate your ombres. You don't want to file it off. Because then we really got a problem. You know, that, that all your hard work just gone. So, remember, and keep your sidewalls clean. You don't want to spend all that time shaping, um, because then you and your client will be there for, like, five hours. Yep. So, here's my application. Now I've shaped. I'm just going to start filing. I'm using a 5-in-1 bit uh, from Pana, and this bit allows you to get really close to the cuticle, but don't push it, bitch. Don't push it, because you could still cut your client... And she will most likely... Oh, wow, I'm really breaking her finger here. Wow. Sorry. Anyways, you can still cut your client and she will most likely not come back. Okay, so do what you will with that information. See? Just gotta be very careful. I like to do this to the end of my tips. I don't like that bulky look. That's just my preference, though. It's also really satisfying. Yeah, here they are, all cleaned up. Shaped them piled. And bam. I fucking did that. It looks so motherfucking good. Thanks!